persevere like the apostles. Shrink not from testifying about Jesus. Acts 20, 19 to 21 says, 19, I serve the Lord with great humility, with tears, especially in the trials that came upon me through the plots of the Jews. Verse 20, I did not shrink back from declaring anything that was helpful to you as I taught you publicly from house to house. And verse 21, testifying to Jews and Greeks alike about repentance to God and faith in our Lord Jesus Christ. Blessed be the reading of His Word. Acts chapter 20 was Paul's journey through Macedonia and Greece and a heart-wrenching farewell to the Ephesian elders. In here, Paul reminds them of his service for the three years he lived in Ephesus planting and building up the church. He reminded them how he served with dedication and self-sacrifice. He boldly taught them anything that was profitable, Acts 20.20, 20, and challenged them to protect their churches from false teachers and to emulate his humble leadership. As Paul anticipates hardships and trials, he gives three significant points here. His courage, his selflessness, and fervor for God's mission shine through, offering valuable lessons for Christian believers like us. Verse 20 says, As he visited the believers at their own houses to know their personal cases and the state of their souls, he instructed them privately and personally one by one. He taught the same publicly as privately and privately as publicly or vice versa and took every opportunity of instilling the gospel truths in them and of enriching them with a larger knowledge of the gospel which shows his affection and seal to all people. As we walk our faith journeys as believers and followers of our Lord Jesus Christ, my friends, May Paul's unwavering dedication inspire us to serve selflessly, endure courageously, and trust steadfastly in God's Word. May we teach the truth of the Gospel without any reservation before all the people, as Christ ordered His disciples to do, and He Himself did. Matthew 10, verse 27, and John 18, verse 20. My friends, the way of the believers is not an easy road. Being a Christian does not solve or remove all problems. All serve humbly and with tears, but he never gave up. The message of salvation was so important that he never missed an opportunity to share it. And although he preached his message in different ways to fit different audiences, the message remained the same. Let's turn away from our sin and turn to Christ by faith. My friends, Paul faced trials, yet he remained faithful to his calling. So in our small group today, let's support one another, let's encourage one another, and persevere together when we face challenges. God bless you all.